Hello and welcome back to Mayo and Taxes. So, uh, you know how I said in the last episode that this was a brand new recording session? Well, guess what? So is this one. About 30 seconds after I ended the last episode, um, my neighbors decided to drill into a wall and they didn't stop for a few hours. So, that was fun. So yeah, um, it's been a couple of days since then and I can't remember what we were doing. Did we literally just finish the war against Genoa? Oh, must be. Okay, fair enough. Well, say Nick, I remember I had military access with you. I no longer need that, so thank you very much. We want to make sure that we get our war exhaustion down. 6.55 is just far too high. It's not good. Um, also hurts diplomatic annexation and integration. So, uh, yeah, definitely get rid of that. Speaking of diplomatic annexation, I did say that I had changed it to, uh, what was it, uh, five points per development to uh, Diplo Annex. Um, I then got some comments uh, saying that it's only, uh, sorry, it's uh, eight in vanilla. So I'd actually made it cheaper than in vanilla. I was under the impression that it was three um, in vanilla, but of course I must have been wrong. And uh, so I've changed it and now it's eight per development to annex here. So uh, now it's 709 for the Empire of the Romans who have um, 69 development. So I still feel it's a little bit expensive, but it's more palatable, I guess. It's, it's half the price that it used to be. So yeah, we'll just have to deal with that. All right, what's this? A warning, the current doge has committed a crime. At the moment, that shouldn't be a problem, but in the future, Michel Barozzi shouldn't intervene in the matters of the Republic if he doesn't want to get into trouble. Me? It's a me, a Mario. All right, so Arbanon, Serbia. Do we have, uh, yeah, we still got a couple of things to integrate and annex and all that. Would be nice if I could take some of these provinces. Nexos has embraced banking. If I was to steal something from Nexos, I imagine we'd be in a little bit of shit with their opinion of me. Um, there's no non-capital problem. Yeah, we can't even take it. Impossible. How about with uh, Empire of the Romans? Can we seize Thraki? Hey, fuck, we actually kind of could. We could totally take Thraki. We can't take that, not a chance. But we could take Thraki, that would give us a port on the Gulf of Varna, which would allow us to take these two. Um, it's now been renamed to Sampsunta. Mm, I'm thinking we'll pass, I think we'll pass for now. Uh, you guys, this is just Mercs, where's the rest of my army? Aha, here you are. Well, you guys... When we gearing up for war against you? Mm, truce is over in 1409, so... While yes, we are gearing up for war against you, it's it's not going to happen just yet. How about you just go here and you can drill? Do I really have mostly mercs in my army? That is indeed the case. I'm going to get rid of one of them. Get back below the force limit. You can continue your trading. I did have a question whether it would be better to actually um, protect trade in the, um, the Gulf of Venice. And I had checked that at one point uh, and saw that it was slightly worse for me. Um, though that was before the Mamluks were embargoing me. So I might try it again. So 1474 make a note of that date and let's see if uh, going into the Adriatic is actually worth more. It does say, say that it's more. 14... what was it? 1484? 1474. 1474. 1474. We'll check on the 1st of February or something. 1474. Nothing we can do with the Curia right now. 
We could check now as well. It doesn't really pay to, though. Oh, wow. I feel like that's going to go up again, because uh, last month we didn't have these guys protecting trade for the entire month. Wow, that is a huge difference. Like, this is what we were making before the Mamluks embargo does. If the Mamluks drop their embargo, we'll probably end up going back to Egypt. Um, but yeah, look, look what they're doing. Negative 139% in Egypt. It's, it's pretty extreme. So this should go up a bit more now that we've had the entire month to trade. 23.16, okay. And we control 50%. Man, if we can if we can get more boats, we'll we'll have all of the trade. I think we do also get Padua's trade as well. Though that will likely end at some point. Does anyone want to Ooh, knowledge sharing. Thessaly and Hum. They're both really bad. Like not neither of those have any money whatsoever. I'm just thinking, can we find somebody that is, I mean, they're, I want to find somebody that is close enough that would, um, we'd be able to give them it, like close enough to, you know, positive numbers, like Arbanon, we, we could probably improve relations enough to get them there. Um, so you've got negative 20 because you're not allied with me. Hum isn't allied with me. He does not have that modifier. And neither is Thessaly. Cilicia, here. I mean, yeah, you're not allied with me, but neither are these guys. And now let's, let's give it to 0.11 versus 0.08. So it looks like we're gonna give that to Thessaly. It's, it's really, really bad. Um, and Invite a Trade League is actually at four. Though they are all in the north. Wait, I only see three. No, wait, no, I see four. It, it's really useless getting these guys in our Trade League. Like, they do nothing for us. I thought you were in my Trade League. Yes, you are, okay. So is Thessaly. So maybe that's actually why he he accepted the uh, the transferring of trade because he's in my trade league, and hum. Aha. Uh -huh, okay, that's why he didn't have the modifier, because he's technically allied to me via trade league, maybe. Marie's opinion of me goes down. I get local trade power in Candia, and the trade value modifier goes down though. Candia is here. Trade value is 254, my trade power is a bit higher. Um, unrest here is at negative 27, so I don't really care about the unrest. But I could get my trade power up. Wait, plus 25, 0.25 trade power, but then negative 10%. So my trade power go to 575 and then drop by 0.575, so that's not worth it. Let's go with this one. They're probably both bad, I don't know. We'll see. We still take five ducats out, even though, I mean, it's just such a good node, to be honest. 19% um, here, taken Eight ducats back to the Adriatic. It's pretty good stuff. In my opinion of Lithuania goes up. They must have embraced Catholicism. Indeed, but Trakai are still Remuva. They do have a syncretic faith though, so there is that. Brandenburg getting fucked up by Mecklenburg Stargard. Always interesting. And what I'm gonna do is start improving relations with some large nations. So, France, and England because we might be able to sell them some um, institutions w if we get to the point where they're um, you know we have them they don't and we're really happy with them 
That's a bit too expensive for the Festa de la Senza. Sorry, no. I don't think I want to do that anymore. Not if I'm... I guess it's because I'm making more money, and they're like, Oh, you're making more money? Now you spend more on this thing. It's like, no, no thank you. Uh, but if we're making 10 ducats a month, or 9 ducats a month... Been insulted by Austria. You bastards. Um, whoa, 12 ducats now. 12 and a half ducats. I like that a lot. If I'm making that much, it's not going to be long before we can start putting in some improvements into Venice. Also, did we get this claim? We did, so there's no reason for us to be uh, looking at them anymore like that. That's, that's useless. Um, maybe Bohemia would be another good target. I could support his independence from... Who, who's your overlord? Junior partner of Mecklenburg Stargard. I will support your independence, because then we would become allies. Feel free to declare at any time. If you're beneath Mecklenburg Stargard, who is fucking tiny. Although, hang on a minute. What's this war about? Mecklenburg Conquest of Haviland. Brandenburg Conquest of Glogau. Why did you think you could take Glogau? Huh. Not a clue. I thought it was going to be a war about, um, you know, the Unification War. I think this might be worth keeping the relation limit. Or going over the relation limit. It might be worth it. Trakai is now Orthodox. Or did they turn Catholic? They turned Catholic. So it's like, oh yeah, we're a pagan, but we love us some orthodoxy. And then they turn Catholic and it's like, no, I fuck orthodoxy. <laughs> also, Sarahan is actually beating the Ottomans. Because they've got Teak on their side as well. You would imagine that the Ottomans would lose here. I mean, they did take Biga. But they're two under siege. Oh, they're here now. With 9,000. But if these guys jo join together, that's more than 9,000. They really should go in and attack. It's only grass flats, though. Hmm. We'll have to wait and see what happens there. I would very much like to see uh, Sarahan win. Lithuania and Teutonic Order both want some friends. Lithuania is at war with the Teutonic Order. And Sweden. Big oof right there. The war is over the Lithuanian conquest of Piltine. Pil Piltine. Which one's Piltine? Well, he doesn't have a claim. Unless it's Trakai's claim. It must be Trakai's claim. Piltine. Piltine. Here it is. Piltine. Piltine wants me to support their independence. You know what? I'll, uh, I'll pass on that one. Faction-wise, how am I doing? Still got the traders, and they are going up. Because Navy tradition and... Or, no, no, no. Is it improving my Navy Tradition, or is it being improved because I've got high Navy Tradition? My Navy Tradition right now is... I always f forget how... There we go. Uh, it's pretty good, and it goes. it's going up still. Nice. Inquisitori. Two of the ten members of the Concilio dei Ten, and one of the Concilieri del Doge, were known as the Inquisitors of the State. Historically, when Venice lost its power in the 17th century, the Inquisitory became more powerful, forming a council within the council. The Inquisitory had to prevent conspiracies against the state and had to deal with high treason. They are a most feared organization in the Republic, known as the Three Babi. Ba Babi. Ba Babi. Baby. The Three Ghosts. To limit the power of the Ten, there are suggestions that the State Inquisitor should be split off from them, creating an independent council. So, we could lose some dip. We could gain Republican tradition for dip. Or we could just gain dip. 
Mm. I like the idea of monarch points. Monarch points are nice, especially when I'm almost get crayers. Although I still don't want to build them. Hmm. Still, no one in the south wants to join McTrade Lake, which is unfortunate. 51%. So, Venice, looking at your buildings again, the thing I want is 975. Yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a choice between the art corporation and the local university. And I, I just can't think that I would want... I mean, I want the art corporation, of course, but the university is better for urban gravity. Plus five base versus plus two base and plus five percent modifier. Hmm. How can you see urban gravity? Is it here? Urban gravity, 164,000. Right, so plus five to 164,000 doesn't seem like a lot. But I doubt it. I doubt it works that way. I really, really doubt it works that way. Um, I mean, obviously, I want both, but I think getting a university is, is going to be better because I need the uh, I need the lovely education. In past times, the Serene Doge used to be on the reverse side of the coins. Oh, we've seen this one before. Um, yeah, reject that reform. That reform is pretty wank. Could get a trader, or I could get myself. Warehouse district. I mean, I'm not, I'm not really too sold on this. However, I do need to not fall too far behind in my tech, so I will, I will take it. I also want this. This, this looks good. Provincial trade power modifier is going to be huge, especially for like Venice itself. Probably got a huge amount of provincial trade power. Um, Yeah, it's this one. Uh, it's got a provincial trade power of 25.5, which is pretty fucking sweet. Trade power affects how much power the province owner receives from the province in the connected trade node. Trade power also improves urban wealth in the province. So getting trade power up is good. Lots and lots of good stuff. We've got, we're a major center of trade, so it gives me more force limit. And urban gravity, plus 7.5 urban gravity and 20%. Modifier. That's huge. Um, are we a center of production as well? I don't see it there. But there's a lot of local wealth here as well. Uh, ecclesiastical writings, we will get that prestige. That's just the best one, I think. Yeah, we're not a... We're not a construction hub yet. I'm going to need um, this this corporation guild for that. This would probably put me there. I need an urban population of 50k. Oh, 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 whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh. whoa. 7k dudes in Chalcedici. I do say that's a little bit wank, but we can fix it. Go pick up my dudes. We've got enough boats to land everyone all at once. So I'll probably end up doing that. These guys are still fighting Genoa and Aragon. That war has been going on for a significant amount of time. States, Peloponnese. Peloponnese, actually, I do want to make into a, a state. So I will do exactly that. And we will core it up. I also want to make myself a cannon next time I have a bit more force limit. I'm not there just yet. Come on, get on a boat. Eventually he will be on the boat. Where are the boats? There they are. Um, how long will it take you to go to Achaea? 25th of March, perfect. So we dock here, then we bring the boats around to Magnesia while the dudes walk to Magnesia. And 
And then we just land on his face with everybody and, and murder face. Oh, it looks like the Ottomans have taken back uh, control of this war. That's a shame. When the AI works together, they can do really decent stuff, but they just never work together. KOTOR has been cored. Very nice. It's, a, it's not the most amazing province yet, but it is controlled by the burgers, which is exactly what I want. Negative 21%. We're definitely going to be able to do this. We'll have this battle and then we'll end the episode. God, it took him so long. Probably should have just had him get back on the boats. Uh, Michael Barozzi's great work. Oh! Yeah, no, fuck. I. Mm. It's 200 ducats, which. 200 ducats is like. 20, 20. It's about two years worth of income, roughly. Two years worth of income. But that would get almost half of the work complete, and this is a really good building. Do you already have one yet? Paris, do you have one yet? You do. Great Cathedral, Art Power, Urban Gravity Modifier plus 25%. Art Power from Upper, uh, Urban Upper Class, 25%. Lowers Unrest, who cares about Missionary Strength, gives me some yearly prestige, tolerance of the true faith and yearly papal influence. It's really good. I'm going to go all in, all in. All right, let's go kick this guy's ass. Get out of my friend's territory, you bastards. Eventually. Yep, 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 dead. Yeah. So, that was pretty good. And uh, with that, we will be putting a cut in here, so I hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you did, feel free to click the like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye for now.